want to know <clears throat> if, if it's a name droppers show because you've you've worked with some of the greats. You've been in some amazing things. Go on, give us your who's who's your all time name dropper. Well, hang Definitely. on a second before we go there, Paul. Let, let me give you a little rundown of some of the some of the ones we've had. So we interviewed Bruce Grobler uh, yesterday. Bruce said that um, he got chatted up by uh, Freddie Mercury um, <laughs> at a gig. Um, and asked him if he was straight. <laughs> and Bruce said, no. He said, that's a shame. Let me know if you ever change your mind. That was, <laughs> we had John Barnes talking about um, dance, uh, dancing, playing football with Marvin Gaye in his back garden when he was 14. And, and Barnes's mum, I don't know if you know this, Rob, was a TV presenter um, no. back in Jamaica. And so she met a lot of the big stars. And, and Barnes, he let slip that he had dinner, sat at the same table as Bob Marley. So wow. yeah, so listen, you've got some you've got That's some top draw that by the way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So well, you know, my one's OJ Simpson. Um Rob McCaffrey's is Joey Jones, the legendary Joey Jones. <laughs> so he's the top man there. The top as <laughs> man. <laughs> so come on, we, we, what, give us a give us a couple then, Paul. Come on. Well, some of the names that you mentioned, I have I have met. If you know oh, what I mean. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I've met your Barnsey and uh, I've met your Brucey's, your Brucey Grobbelars. Uh, so, and I've met a lot of the footballers, as you say. Um, yeah. But um, but they're starting to lose the value now because everybody's saying them. You know what I mean? Even even Nelson Mandela. Rod, Big Ron Atkins has said Nelson Mandela. John Barnes said Nelson Mandela. Brucey said Nelson Mandela. I said, I'm gone. <laughs> it's losing its, it's losing its value now. <laughs> I can't, I can't, no, no. Uh, when we went on the red carpet for the Oscars for um, the full Monty, you know, I, I, ju I just looked over and I thought, oh, man, it's Walter Matthau. Wow. <laughs> Walter Matthau. So I went, up, I went up to him and I said, Mr. Matthau, I am so, you know, I loved all his films and all that, you know, the the, um, the odd couple and everything else. And all he said to me was, my accountant's not here, is he? Do you know what I mean? And that was it. And I thought, that'll do for me, you know what I mean? And I shook his hand, and that was it. Lovely. And, Lovely. Yeah. Uh, don't know who else. Robin Williams. Oh, wow. Where did you meet Robin Williams? On the red carpet. Oh. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. <laughs> it's pretty good, Paul. That's it's pretty, pretty good. good. Red red carpet, red carpet that. With Walter Matto and Robin Williams. I'm, 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 I'm heading up there with that. <laughs> yeah. There were, and Samuel L. Jackson. Oh, oh yeah. Because I um I watched Samuel, I watched Pulp, Fic Pulp Fiction on the plane over to the USA. Great film, yes. So yeah, yeah. when I'm on the red carpet, I went up to him and I said, I've just seen you in Pulp Fiction and all that, and shook his hand and all that. He said, but, uh, but... I'm going to be doing a film in Liverpool and all that. I said, oh, all right, yeah. So that was it. And it was 51st State. And it was 51st that, State, that, yeah. That you, that you were in as well? Yeah. Brilliant. Did you have a chance to, to get closer to him and chat to him more and show him around Liverpool? Some of some of your some of your old haunts? Not really. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. He was a, he, a lovely man, but I mean, all you can say is he's American. Yeah. And like Americans are Americans. They they come on stage, you know, with a with an entourage. Yeah. You know, say their lines. The entourage, you know. Yeah. Come on, surround him and, and escort him off the set. 